50 years after the lunar landing, man is going back to the moon after a fashion as part of the Apollo 11 immersive live show. It officially opens tonight in Los Angeles under a massive lunar dome. It's designed to recreate the iconic mission in an iconic way. Our Roseanne Aragon was the only Houston reporter invited to give viewers a sneak preview of the show. She's joining us live now from Los Angeles. Roseanne? We are, we are just so excited to be here. They gave us a little sneak peek of that show and it is really incredible. This is it, this is the lunar dome behind me that was built just for this show. And another element in the show is a true to size replica of a lunar lander. One of the many different things you will see to create this unique experience. And it's so inspiring. It's just an amazing story. The story of how America got man to the moon. But this time in this newly built lunar dome, it'll be a new kind of experience. It's Apollo 11, the immersive live show. I've been working on this project for three years. The show, which premieres here in Los Angeles Wednesday night, takes place just outside the Rose Bowl Stadium. <laughs> Where preparations are already underway. The show itself is inside this newly built 1600 seat lunar dome with state of the art technology, including 40,000 square feet of video projection. We have an original score, which we recorded in London a couple of months ago with a 70 piece orchestra. All to tell the story of the 1969 lunar landing through the eyes of a retired aerospace engineer, one of 400,000 people who worked to bring JFK's vision to life 50 years ago. And of course, the show will eventually come to Houston. Producers asked Apollo 11 Gold Flight Director Jerry Griffin to make sure it was right. Extremely accurate. It's right on the money. Taking viewers to the moon by launching a life-sized rocket while showing it on a 360-degree cylindrical video element. It's the largest touring venue of its kind in the world. The show uh, is an honor for the people that, that actually made it uh, happen 50 years ago. A sense of history shared for generations. Our goal is not only to entertain, but to educate and inspire. And we also spoke with lead actors ahead of tonight's premiere on the red carpet. We're also told there will be several special guests from the Apollo 11 mission itself. We will be on the red carpet tonight bringing you this experience. Reporting live from Pasadena, Roseanne Aragon, KPRC, Channel 2 News.